Welcome to Moomoo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about the six kingdoms of classification. They include the animal kingdom, the plant, fungi, protists, bacteria, and archaea. The animal kingdom is an extremely diverse group of individuals. Some animals are giant like the blue whale, where others are tiny like an ant. Some have a complex nervous system and are intelligent, where others are simple like a sponge. Here are some common traits. Animals are heterotrophs, which means they eat other organisms for food. Animals are multicellular, meaning they are made up of more than one cell. Animals are eukaryotic, meaning they have membrane-bound organelles and a nucleus. They also, most cells in animals are diploid, which means they have two pairs of chromosomes. The plant kingdom contains large trees, flowers, and other plants found around you. Let's see what they have in common. First, plants are autotrophs, meaning they can get their food from the sun through photosynthesis. They contain a cell wall, and plants are multicellular. Fungi range from mushrooms to yeast. Some mushrooms are multicellular, and others are unicellular. Fungi are eukaryotes and contain a cell wall. Fungi are also heterotrophs. Some are decomposers, while others are parasites. The kingdom protus is called the junk drawer kingdom. Protus range from single cell organisms like euglena to multicellular kelp. Some are plant-like, others are animal-like, some are fungi, but most are found in moist environment. As the catch-all kingdom for eukaryotic organisms, if an organism is not an animal, a plant, or fungi, it is most likely thrown in the protus kingdom. Some protists are heterotrophs, others are autotrophs. Next, bacteria. Bacteria are single cells. They are prokaryotes, which means they do not have an organized nucleus or membrane-bound organelles. They do have a cell wall, and some move with a flagella. Bacteria are all around us. They help us digest food, sometimes make us sick, but also help us make yogurt. And finally, archaea are prokaryotes, like bacteria, but they are structurally different. Many are found in extreme environments, such as extreme temperatures, extreme salty conditions, or little or no oxygen. So there we go, the six kingdoms that make up classification. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.